Hi everybody, a very pregnant Carla here with you on Mama Says TV. As you can see, I am, well, partially see, I am ready to go anytime soon. But I'm gonna be prepping myself some witch hazel particles um, that I'm gonna be using to soothe myself after I've just given presumably natural birth. Okay, so the supplies needed to make the witch hazel particles are very simple, easy to find, maybe at Shoppers, Walmart, whatever. So get yourself some maxi pads. I got these ones. Thicker is better, I find. So you also want to get the pad that has this. So you can seal the pad back up after you've placed the witch hazel onto the pad. Here's the witch hazel. Nothing fancy. Just a life brand. That's all you need. And to place the pads in the freezer, you might want a large Ziploc baggie. That's it. Okay, very simple. Just open up your pad. Just like that. I'm using a syringe just because I find it's easier to control how much I'm putting on. So, I use about 50 mils, whatever. These are big pads. Right in the middle where it's gonna be. On you, just like that. All you need. Okay, so while I'm bagging my witch hazel soak pads, I just wanted to mention quickly that the witch hazel padsicle coming out of the freezer is going to feel so good and soothing on your sore lady bits. Uh, this is going to help reduce any inflammation that you have, which I'm sure there is, and reduce any skin irritations that you may ha may or may not get from the stitches. Uh, who knows? but it's always best to be prepared, right? So yay, natural birth. Well, there you have it. Throw that bag into the freezer. Take one out when ready to use. This also makes a great gift for a loved one, a family friend who have just given natural birth. And with all of that, I just wanted to say congratulations on your very hard work. And thank you for watching. Bye-bye for now.